System Restore uses Restore Points to return your computer to an earlier point in time without affecting your personal files. This is good if a problem occurs with your system. Restore Points are created automatically every week. Additionally, when you use System Restore, a Restore Point is created before proceeding, so you can undo the changes if desired. In this video, you will learn how to manually create a Restore Point, perform a System Restore, and undo the System Restore if it doesn't help. To manually create a Restore Point, click on Start. Now right click on Computer, and select Properties. Select System Protection. System Properties will open on the System Protection tab. Click Configure. Configure allows you to define restore settings and disk space for system protection as well as delete all restore points. Click OK to close. Click Create and assign a name for your restore point. Click Create and your restore point will be created. You have now manually created a system restore point that can be used to restore your computer to a desired known good operating state if you are experiencing problems. Once the restore point has been successfully created, click Close. Next we will perform a system restore using the created restore point. Before you start system restore, save any open files and close all programs. If you are prompted for an administrator password or confirmation, type the password or provide confirmation. Click on Start. Enter Restore into the search field. And select System Restore. System Restore will open. If your system has been recently updated or you installed new programs and or drivers, you will see two options. The first option is a recommended restore point, usually the last restore point created by the computer. The second option allows you to choose the restore point yourself. Choose the option that best suits your needs and click Next. If you do not see these options, click Next. Your manually created restore point is shown. Select the Show More Restore Points box to display more restore points if available. Select your created restore point and click Next. Confirm your restore point and click Finish. Once started, System Restore cannot be interrupted. If running System Restore in safe mode, it cannot be undone. Click Yes to continue or No to stop System Restore. When Yes is clicked, System Restore performs its functions and will restart your computer. When the computer restarts, you are notified of the System Restore. Click Close. If System Restore doesn't fix the problem, you can undo the restore operation by going into System Restore again as explained earlier and selecting Undo System Restore. This will take the computer back to the state before performing this particular System Restore. You can also select Choose a different restore point to return the computer to a different point in time when the computer was functioning correctly. For more information, visit support.toshiba.com.